Hey guys, it's Analyze here, and today I'm going to be doing a plugin tutorial on a plugin I love called World Guard. It is a great plugin I've used on many servers. So, yeah, let's get right to it. So, here's my little house that I made. Just a little square, and because it's square, it's going to be easier. So, you need a World Edit one. It's good if you have like uh, past experience with World Edit to know this plugin. So, what you want to do, what you want to do, a little lag there. Is just select each corner of the house. You can either either like do sit here and do slash slash up one, or you can just right click the right click the floor and do expand vert. Now it's all the way to the sky, all the way to the uh, build limit, all the way to bedrock. Now to uh, create a region, just do slash rg. Define, and let's just, name, let's just name this one house. So now this is known as house. It doesn't have any flags yet, so you uh, to add a flag, you can do RG flag, and then house. But uh, you can look at them, just put a bunch of random stuff, and you can look at all the flags. So you can do something like PVP deny. So now if you're inside of this house, under here or inside, you cannot PvP. You can also turn mob spawning off, which is pretty useful. So now mobs won't spawn in there. Um, there's a lot of different command or flags you can add. You can block commands. You can you can make them invincible. You can stop grass from growing. You can have a feed delay, deny spawn, you can have EXP drops denied or allowed. You can deny creeper explosions. It's a really nice plugin and I, I highly suggest it for like safeguarding spawns and stuff. And yeah, so if this video helped you out at all, please like and subscribe uh, and uh, leave in the comments which plugin I should do next. See you guys later.